Yo, what it is, YouTube? It's your boy Nitsit coming back with another Bullseye with video here today on the channel. I really, really am happy to talk about this one today. Something very interesting. I wanted to go over did we find the quiet CL1B killer? The PSP old timer, you know, this one is pretty good right here. I'm really excited to bring this little vocal sauce today. You know, if you guys do um, have any more comments or questions down below, go ahead and drop it. I'm more than happy to get to it. So let's go ahead and listen to a little bit of, you know, like the music that we're working with here today. And let's get an idea of, you know, is, is this the PSP old timer? Can, can it hang? You know, can the old timer hang with the CL1B? Come on. How do love three people in the year? I'm screaming, rest in peace. I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling Stay for everyone and they fuck all they feeling With my money at with bills, tell her that I got it Pull up in a brand new bench, differences I bought it Niggas say I'm overrated, overestimated Damn bro if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hate it Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded Why he saw to me, ain't no sorry that I tolerated I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin My little dog be wildin' really cut, it came from nothing All they know is it is See a art, they gon' start busting. All they know is Robin doing fraud forever and thugging. Yeah. Why do things gotta change? Why it can't stay the same? Got a lot on my brain. All right, so you guys got the general idea of it today, and I wanted to talk about a little bit about the history. So let's look at what these three compressors have in common: the LA two A, a LA three A. All right, and then last thing after that, uh, a Fairchild. What's the one thing that these all throwback old compressors, you know, the first compressors all got in common? They don't let you dial in the attack and the release. Now, for these very, very first two, the LA-2A and the 3A, of course, they have the optical component in it, which is like a little cell, you know, that whenever, um, you know, the signal comes to the light, the light starts to get brighter and brighter and brighter, right? So that does the compression with the Fairchild actually uses the tubes to do the uh, compression. So the main thing about the um, Fairchild is that you see it has time constants. They don't really have no attack and release. It has a fixed attack and release and everything like that. And the main thing, too, about the 3A and the 2A they, they have a fixed threshold so with the fixed threshold it's kind of like if you're going uh into somebody's house you're walking into their realm you know the fixed threshold kind of means like okay like we have our own motion we got our own stuff at our crib like come here you know what i mean you're walking into what they have which is their threshold their boundaries their line that they had on set so that's the thing about it you know with the older compress with the older compressors they did not really let you dial in the attack and release you know they were used mostly for broadcast and radio it's not like they really needed it but when people started to use it for music they needed something that was quicker faster a lot more responsive and then the la2a's they started the the, the, the parts started going uh you know out of stock it started to become hard for stuff to come in stock kind of like when it was 2020 pandemic you know a lot of stuff out of stock so you know it made the price of stuff going up so that's what you know the la um the cl1b had came in to replace the la2a you know it brought us that same great throwback optical compressor sound but it also brought the new type of you know invention which is the variable attack and release so that's why people love using the CL1B. Um, you know, that's why it's just people keep talking about it because that's pretty much why it lets you dial in the attack and release where like a 2A, 3A, you know, all the throwback compressors really did not let you start to get in there and dial it in. Okay, so we always know the attack is how quick that we we, we grabbing on to the, um, you know, the signal and the release is how quick we let go of it. So it's like if you, you if you was outside playing with some flowers or something like that, like how in the flowers is up in the air, like the dandelions or whatever, like how quick do you grab that flower? Flower, do you slowly grab it like that in the air or do you snatch you snatch that bit you feel me that's what a fast attack would be when you snatch that bit and then a release is like how quick do you let go of it you know sometimes if you do got them flowers in your hands in the wind picking that bit up sometimes you just you just let it go slowly and it, it comes out of your hand that's like a, a slower a medium release or sometimes you just completely drop it out of your hand that would be a fast release all right cool so let's try to dial in something real quick with this uh cl1b and let's just kind of hear like you know What's the type of vibe, the type of swag that we can get from something like a CL1B? You know, how I usually like to dial it in. I don't like to do too much compression. I usually use it only about like one to two B, just tapping it for the tonality, the weight, you know. And this thing, it has a very beautiful thing to it because it can give you a lot of weight in the body from the tools, but then it also has a little bit of brightness. All right, so let's let's look at how I would dial in a CL1B live. I just want to put my problem to the ceiling. Stay for everyone and they fuck all they feeling. With my money at with bills, tell her that I got it. Pull up in a brand new bench, differences I bought it. Niggas say I'm overrated, overestimated. Damn, bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hate it. Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded. Why he saw to me, ain't no 
sorry that not tolerated. I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin. My little dog be wildin', really, cut it came from nothing. All they knew is it's see a art, they gon' start busting. All they know is robbing, doing fraud, forever thugging. I just wanna put my problem into the ceiling. Stay for everyone and then fuck all they feeling. With my money, yeah, with bills, tell her that I got it. Pull up in a brand new bench, differences I bought it. Nigga say I'm overrated, overestimated. Damn, bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hated. Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded. Why he sides to me? Ain't no sorry that I tolerated. I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin. My little dog be wildin', really, cut it came from nothing. All they knew is it is see a art, they gon' start busting. All they know is robbing, doing fraud, forever thugging. I don't. So usually when I'm looking for a tonality out of the compressor, usually when I'm looking for some honey, ranch, garlic, lemon, pepper seasoning, what I always do is I only I don't do too much attenuation, you know, especially with something like a CL1B because it's a, at the end of the day, it's an optical compressor. Even though it says fast attack or fast release, all that, it's still at the end of the day, it's still optical compressor. In the terms of actual compression, it doesn't really move that quick. So I, I usually don't try to make it work too hard. I don't try to make it clamp all the way in the fives and the sevens. It just kind of craps out to me. So I only usually use it on about one one to two db at the most you know <clears throat> and the main thing about the cl1b is that you hear it adds like it's kind of like a doing an eq move without doing an eq move because i'm understanding the components that the tube is adding a little brightness and also that it's adding a little bit of body so now that i've kind of dialed that in i'm gonna keep that to the side and let's bring in something like the psp uh old timer you know this is a pretty interesting plug-in you know um let's hear how you know what well, can we get a sound that sounds a little bit better than the cl1b using this one I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling. Stay for everyone and then fuck all they feeling. With my money, yeah, with bills, tell her that I got it. Pull up in a brand new bench, differences I bought it. Nigga say I'm overrated, overestimated. Damn, bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hated. Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded. Why he saw to me, ain't no sorry that I tolerated. I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin. My little dog be wildin', really, cut it came from nothing. All they knew is it is see a art, they gon' start busting. All they know is robbing, doing fraud, forever thugging. I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling. Stay for everyone and then fuck all they feeling. With my money, yeah, with bills, tell her that I got it. Pull up in a brand new bench, differences I bought it. Nigga say I'm overrated, overestimated. Damn, bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hated. Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded. Why he saw to me, ain't no sorry that I tolerated. I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin. My little dog be wildin', really, cut it came from nothing. So I don't know what it is, but I really like this PSP old timer, especially when you put it on clear. So um, I'm going to show you guys also towards the end of the video how you can get it for free. If you do have a Pro Tools subscription, I'm going to show you all that as well, too. But I don't know what it is, but somebody this PSP old timer it just sounds so clean. And like, I feel like this plugin is low key kind of underrated. So you see here, you know, with the CL1B or with like a tube compressor, I, I usually like to go through the ratios. Usually I like to use a lighter ratio just to like help it get some of that language. But usually when I want it to... Um, um, you know work a little bit more on the peak energy i use something like a higher ratio a lower ratio will work more on the whole signal you know it's kind of like letting you dive into the whole pool of the signal but uh, um uh, a higher ratio will uh, will mostly start to engage on like kind of like the surface level of the you know the the, the the water you know what i mean so yeah that's how i kind of really feel about this and let's listen to them back and forth and uh, you know if i got a level match i will but i really like this psp old timer you know you have the ratio here this is kind of like a time the attack and release is kind of like uh uh, it's very interesting kind of like the time constants a little bit you know these uh first ones are the fastest ones then the medium ones like 47 that's like average you know attack and release and then the low the, the low ones all the way here is like the slowest ones but usually you know tube compressors they're already kind of slow anyways so when it comes to rap music i like to use things that have like a more responsiveness to it is the word you know whatever it gives me more responsiveness and that re um you know pushes and pulls a little bit well with the vocal that's what i usually go for especially also always considering like the tempo of the music too so let's jump between them back and forth and hear which one like really sounds like better you know it's a very interesting interesting plugin i don't want to put my problem to the ceiling stay for everyone and then fuck all they feeling with my money yeah with bills tell her that i got it pull up in a brand new bench differences i bought it nigga say i'm overrated overestimated damn bro if i make it i'ma laugh at everyone who hated remember getting
faded Then I remember all them times I faded Why he to me, ain't no sorry that I tolerated I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin My little dog be wildin' really cause they came from nothing All they know is that they see a art, they gon' start bustin' All they know is Robin doing fraud forever thuggin' I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling Stay for everyone and they fuck all they feeling With my money at with bills, tell her that I got it Pull up in a brand new bench, difference is I bought it Niggas say I'm overrated, overestimated Damn bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hate it Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded Why he saw to me, ain't no sorry that I tolerated I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin My little dog be wildin' really cut, they came from nothing All they know is that they see art, they gon' start bustin' All they know is Robin doing fraud forever thuggin' I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling Stay for everyone and they fuck all they feeling With my money at with bills, tell her that I got it Pull up in a brand new bench, difference is I bought it Niggas say I'm overrated, overestimated Damn bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hate it Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded Why he saw to me, ain't no sorry that I tolerated I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin My little dog be wildin' really cut, they came from nothing All they know is that they see a art, they gon' start bustin' All they know is Robin doing fraud forever thuggin' I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling Stay for everyone and they fuck all they feeling With my money at with bills, tell her that I got it Pull up in a brand new bench, difference is I bought it Niggas say I'm overrated, overestimated Damn bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hate it Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded Why he saw to me, ain't no sorry that I tolerated I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin My little dog be wildin' really cut, they came from nothing All they know is that they see a art, they gon' start bustin' All they know is Robin doing fraud forever thuggin' I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling Stay for everyone and they fuck all they feeling With my money at with bills, tell her that I got it Whew. Guys, guys, I can't lie. Just considering the fact that this is like a hundred and forty dollar plugin, considering the fact that I'm gonna show you guys how you could get this plugin for free. This um, you know, old timer. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm not gonna lie. The difference does not sound like the difference that you would think it would. You know, like this plugin right here, when it's on sale, it's like 20 bucks. And this is like when it's on sale, it's like 149. And if it's not on sale for UAD, this is like going in the 300s. And the difference sounds like little to nothing. So if you don't have either one of these plugins, well, guess what? You can use something like the uh you can use something like the Waves R comp. You know, and the waves are comp, you know, it, it will do that magic thing as well where, uh, you know, let's see how I will dial it in. So this is for the people who keep making excuses. You know, I see y'all lately, you know, in the comments. Oh, I don't have this plugin. I don't. But what I told you about that, you know what I mean? Like the plugins don't matter. You know, there's always going to be a way that you can do it better and in your own way. So you should be finding your own tools that will help you do what you got to do. All right, cool. So let's just kind of look at this right now as well. I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling Stay for everyone and they fuck all they feeling With my money at with bills, tell her that I got it Pull up in a brand new bench, difference is I bought it Niggas say I'm overrated, overestimated Damn bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hate it Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded Why he saw to me, ain't no sorry that I tolerated I was in the set, I lost two niggas and my cousin My little dog be wildin' really cut, they came from nothing All they know is that they see a art, they gon' start bustin' All they know is Robin doing a fraud forever thuggin' Why do they? I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling Stay for everyone and they fuck all they feeling With my money at with bills, tell her that I got it Pull up in a brand new bench, difference is I bought it Niggas say I'm overrated, overestimated Damn bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hate it Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded Why he saw so usually if I do want to get the CL1B sound without actually using it, I'll use the Waves R comp, then I'll use something after it like, uh, you know, like that new plugin that they got, the BB tube. So I'm understanding like the whole signal flow of a CL1B, optical compressor with variable attack and release, then a, 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 you know, a tube input and output. So that's what I usually use and I turn the transformer on. CL1B has a transformer in it too. So, you know, that's what I'm always talking about. If you guys don't have the same exact plugin, well, guess what? Go find your own plugin that will do the same exact job. Now it's even better because it's your 
your trick. Now it belongs to you. Now it's your sauce. Now it's your swag. So you got to understand that. And the last thing too, you know, real quick, I'm not even going to waste no time on this. I love to use the CL1B on parallel. And when I use it on parallel, it's just really like, it, I never push the output on the CL1B just because I don't like how the output sounds. You know, I always try to tell you guys, clean output and dirty output is two different things, you know? Like this fader right here, if you push this, this is clean output, you know what I mean? But if you push like the um the output knob on like an analog model plugin, it's going to give you some color. It's going to give you some seasoning, some salt, some pepper. It has a flavor to it versus where the other one, like the one in your DAW, does not have a flavor to it. So I like to use this on uh, parallel compression. And let's look at both of them real fast, real fast. Me, ain't no sorry that I tolerate it. I just want to put my problem to the ceiling. Stay focused on the with my money yeah, with bills, tell her that I got it Pull up in a brand new binge, differences I bought it Niggas say I'm overrated, overestimated Damn bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hate it Remember getting faded, then I remember all them times I faded Why he saw to me, ain't no sorry that I tolerated I was in the cell, I lost two niggas and my cousin My little dog be wildin', really cut, it came from nothing All they know is that they see a they gon' start bustin' All they know is robbin', doin' fraud forever, thuggin' I just wanna put my problem to the ceiling Stay for everyone and then fuck all they feeling With my money yeah, with bills, tell her that I got it Pull up in a brand new binge, differences I bought it Niggas say I'm overrated, overestimated Damn bro, if I make it, I'ma laugh at everyone who hate it so that's what I really love the CL1B for. It really helps the vocal get this type of chest, like this really type of weight, this really boldness to it that I like a lot. All right, so I'm going to show you guys how you can get the PSP old timer for free if you do have Pro Tools. What you do is you go to um, Avid Inner t inner inner Circle, and then you go to PSP Audio Wear, and you go to, like, Redeem, and it will let you, like, redeem it and all that stuff. So, you know, and like I said, you know, when the plugin does go on sale, this PSP old timer, it's only, like, $20. So, I mean, shoot, if you can tell me how you feel down below, I feel like they sound the same to me. Honestly, I wouldn't be making no excuses. If I had the PSP old timer, I would feel like I don't even need a CL1B. Only thing about the UADC, CL1B is that you do get the track with it, which I feel like that is important too. So that would be a reason why I do get the CL1B, you know, because sometimes when people are recording and they can hear that CL1B sound, it's going to make them feel a little bit better by themselves because it's that same mainstream type of tone, you know, type of situation. So it helps them get a little more confidence. I ain't going to lie. But I think that when it comes to a mixing situation that this PSP old timer is holding up, it's holding up and it's only a $20 plugin. So that's why I always talk about stop making excuses. I literally just showed you how like a $20 plugin can sound like what a $300 plugin you know what I mean so just want to say thanks a lot for being a great part of my YouTube family don't forget to like comment and subscribe now peace